Hey everybody, welcome back. Mike here at MH Tutorials. Well guys, today we're going to do another short video in the series of short videos with a quick uh, tip if you want. And today we are going to explain how to create a custom shelf in Maya. Now, what is a shelf? You see these tabs up here, general curves, surfaces, and so forth. These are shelves. And each shelf has a number of tools, options, and so forth, like here, 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 here. Okay. Now, what I'm going to show you is how to create your own shelf. Now, you might ask, why would I do that? Now, if you're not accustomed to using a lot of shortcuts to do stuff in, in Maya, then you are moving up and down to Edit Mesh, Extrude, and so forth. And if you have a project where you need to do that a lot, it's going to take you a lot of time. So what you can do is create a specific project shelf that will allow you to gather functions that you use a lot. Okay, that's what I'm going to show you. So we're going to go up to Window, Settings and Preferences. We're going to go down to Shelf Editor, and here's a list of your current shelves, and you can see them moving along as we click down, right? And we're going to click on this button right here, and New Shelf. Now, we're going to name that. I'm just going to call this Project Shelf, but you can name it anything you want. We're going to click down here somewhere. And as you can see, it's now at the second position. So I got general, I got project shelf, but I can move that up to the first position by clicking on this arrow or moving down by clicking on that one. I'm going to click up, so I'm in the top position, but there's nothing in there yet, right? Save all shelves. Now simply just start to model. So I'm going to go up to create polygon primitives sphere, all right? I'm going to drag that out. Now, let's say this project, I need to create a lot of different spheres and so on. What I can do is, as soon as I select this thing, right here, you see, this is the last tool that I used. In this case, create a polygon sphere. I'm going to middle mouse click on that, and I'm going to hold it, drag it up, and release it on my shelf. Like that. And you can do that with every tool that shows up here. So... If I move this out and delete it, if I go to my custom shelf right here and I click on this, I can drag it out. That's all there's to it. So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully this tip was helpful and see you guys next time. Bye.